Hey, hey, what's up? Welcome to another episode with a good deal guy. I want to show you guys this. Uh, this is my new camera. This is like a smart camera with two, two lens, and then uses uh, app seven, apps smart seven twenty. So, I'm going to show you guys how to install this on your phone. Okay, so bear with me. This is actually really cool. This is wired, but you put it outside or you can put it inside, and it has two cameras. So it's a stationary one and this one. Just bear with me. I'm not at my desk, so I'm just doing this in my basement. So what do you want to do in the package? You actually have the manual, okay? And there's a QR code on there, so you want to scan that real quick. What I do, I just open my phone. And if you hold it over it, you're going to see that little yellow thing that pops. You touch that, and it goes to your app store. Okay? It's Cam 7. Okay, so this is the one you want to get. If you use Android or if you use Apple, or you can get that, okay? It's free. So it takes a couple of seconds. I want to show you guys this real quick as well. So it comes with a cord. The cord is very long. It's Type-C and then a proximity camera. Now there's another cord here. This is if you want to connect it with the internet cable to your modem or to your router. But we're gonna do this wirelessly, so you only have to plug the power. Okay. There's a space here for memory card. You can actually open this with memory card. This is the speaker. It's two-way voice. Super cool, so you can hear them. And on this side, you have the two cameras. Okay. So let's do the app quick. So it says app is installed. You're gonna push open. It asks you to agree with the terms. You confirm. Okay, so you have to actually push that thing to confirm. Perfect. Now, it goes right here and it says, allow cam, allow cam 720 to send notifications. Allow, okay. Now, <clears throat> because this is your first time, you wanna push that thing on top, where it says, no account, sign up now. So we push that. I have read and agreed. <clears throat> no account. So it goes to country or region. So it depends where you live. You put your country. This one, we are in Canada. So I'll put Canada. Confirm and confirm. Now it goes to this page here. It says create account. Okay. So you want to put in your email. All right, and it says choose a password. So you want to choose a password that's easy for you to remember, right? So here it gives you the page so you can put your email and then it says next step. I push next. It goes here. It tells you for verification, okay? right here it gives a verification so to your email so what do you want to do you want to go to your email real quick and you get a six digit you want to copy and paste that and it says registered okay so because you hear that beep guys when you plug this in it's gonna hear you're gonna hear the beep that means that's ready to be paired okay so it just goes off until you do it so we go to the main page here and it says add a device you can do that or in the corner this is add a device so you're gonna go to add device now it tells you a wi-fi connection wired connection that's if you want to do it with a wire and Add a 4G camera. We're going to do Wi-Fi. So you want to push that first one. Wi-Fi connection. Okay. And then it says you have to enable your location services. Okay. So we go to our permissions, location, and allow while using the app. Okay. So 
that should solve that problem. If you get that message, that's what you have to do. Now, now you go here, it says reset camera. You don't have to reset it if you heard the prompt. And then you just push that little thing that says, I heard the prompt at the bottom. Then you push next. Now, it says connect to the camera hotspot. So what you wanna do, it's actually super easy. This is where a lot of people get confused. All you have to do, go to your Wi-Fi. I'm gonna show you guys, don't worry. Settings, connection, Wi-Fi. Now give it a second. See, you're gonna see some Wi-Fi's there. Obviously you're gonna see the Wi-Fi at your place. And then you're gonna see these other Wi-Fi's. This is a Wi-Fi for this camera here. It's called JAA, the number there. You have to connect that. So you're gonna to touch that real quick. It says connecting. And then it's gonna give you a message. It says internet might not be available. It's okay. So see, it gives you this message here. And just push the tab, it says connect only this time anyway, just connect it. And that's it, that's all you have to do. And then you go back to the app. Okay, so let me go back to the app here quick. So <clears throat> it was telling us to go connect to this, right? We already did that. So it says push next. Now here it is, it's gonna go choose the Wi-Fi, right? So you're gonna see your Wi-Fi on top there, and then you have to put your password to connect, make sure because it's a case sensitive. Next, I think I remember my own Wi Fi. And then Repeat it's, configuration information. It just gives you a little timer, but it received the information. Connecting to the network. It's connecting to the network. Network connection successful. Perfect. Camera is online. Okay, so now the camera is online. It offers you a plan for the cloud storage, but you don't have to because you're gonna put a memory card in this camera, so, but they always try to push that, so, no, cancel, I don't need it. Wow, look at this, so this is actually really cool. So, just to show you guys real quick. I'm gonna turn this camera. Actually, here, let me push it this way so you can see better. You have two cameras here. I don't know if you noticed, you have the top one and you have the bottom one. So let me turn this around again. So you have the top and the bottom one. The top one stays and the bottom one moves. Let's check this out. I'm gonna make another video soon. I'm gonna make another video and I go through all the features and all the how to set up all the settings in this camera after I installed it. That's the reason I installed it to my basement because I need an extra camera, so I'm gonna use this. But if you guys are brand new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe so you can see all my reviews. And if you have any questions, just leave a comment there. And thank you so much for watching.